Hello guys and welcome back to a new video on my channel. In this video, I'll analyze Tottenham's new signing, Tangang Dumbele. By the way, he scored in his Premier League debut against Aston Villa as Tottenham won 3-1. Before we start analyzing his play style, I would like to give you a quick look on his stats. Dumbele showed consistency during the past two seasons. That's something that is very important as it adds confidence to the manager when buying a new player. So as you can see from these stats, in 2018-19 season, he played 34 games, scored 1 goal and assisted 7. His past success rate was 89.1, his average rating was 6.99, while in the 2017-18 season, he played 32 games, he didn't score any goal, but he assisted 6. His past success rate was 89.4 and maintained an average rating of 7.25 so you can see that the stats are pretty close now let's get a closer look on his play style so first of all Ndumbele plays as the right center midfielder in Lyon's 4-4-2 or 4-2-3-1 his main strength is his first touch Ndumbele's positional awareness is very good this allows him to perform a triple or a body feint when receiving the ball to get rid of the pressure using his first touch. He is responsible to switch the play from the back with these low long passes. He always moves after playing the pass to create passing options. This is something that is very important when playing as a midfielder. Don't be active only, but move into spaces and between the lines. Another thing that must be counted as a strength to him is the one touch passes. Just like his first touches, he takes the advantage due to his good positional awareness. You can see here this amazing one touch fancy flare pass that resulted into a goal. Ndumbele is also very good in getting the ball out from the back, either by playing a long pass or carrying it out under his feet. Here he didn't find the teammate to pass him the ball, so he carried the ball out himself to get use of the space. He is very good in playing these long through passes, he sometimes gets the playmaker responsibilities from his position. Here is why his positional awareness helps him very much. Also notice his quick decision. Moving into space right after playing the pass. From this clip, you can see how he keeps on moving into spaces and creating passing options after playing a pass, which allows his side to keep the attack going and spread around the pitch. His first touch allows him to eliminate the opposition and get rid of the pressure applied on him. Again here you can see how he noticed the opposition behind him, so he performs this dribble by letting the ball go to turn around and get use of the space behind him. He controls the rhythm of the attacks by these one-touch passes when needed.
He often drops down between the center backs while building up. He is good when it comes to defending, but he has to improve. The stats say that he performs 1.9 tackles per game and performs 0.9 interceptions per game, according to last season's league performances. He does not panic when he is under pressure. He always takes his full time on the ball to play the best pass available and then move to create a passing option. Also, while defending, he depends on his positioning to intercept these kind of balls. At the end, how much would you rate Ndumbele out of 10? Comment below. Thanks for watching.